Everyone, Mark here, TechStack. I want to talk a little bit about document management collaboration. I think in B2B software, we kind of all see it. Uh, lots of great information captured in discovery or, or pre-sale. All that information needs to be handed over to the services team uh, on a successful close. Uh, the problem is that documentation, all those great notes are literally scattered all over the place uh, on local file uh, drives or, or um, random fields in, in CRM or scribbled on a notepad. And there's almost nothing to, to hand over to the services team, which leads to a poor experience for your customer. And, uh, you know, the other scenario, of course, is where you do a ton of great pre-sales engagement and deal doesn't go anywhere. A year later, it comes back and you're like, oh, man, I had all these great notes. What happened to them all? And, you know, unfortunately, Bob has moved on in the organization. Nobody knows where his stuff is. And, and, and you're starting from scratch. Doesn't look great. Kind of solve that with tech stack and by bringing together all these amazing tools from Microsoft, OneNote, SharePoint, Teams, bringing it all together within uh, the CRM platform. And yeah, you can say, oh, doesn't Microsoft do that already? And the reality is it really doesn't, not in an auto way, automated way. So I'm going to show you kind of how we, we work uh, in tech stack and, and improve the, uh, the ability for your uh, internal team to collaborate and work together to a successful close uh, on, and adding customers. Here I have an account, BASF, they're currently a customer, they're at implement stage, they're customers as you can see here. Every account that reaches a certain point of maturity, you can determine what that stage is. We typically recommend prioritize. We automatically associate a, uh, a, a OneNote file to that account. So I'm going to click this. It's going to open up another window, which is my OneNote file. Now, OneNote's really cool because it allows everybody in the organization to collaborate in a single place. And, and the nature of, of OneNote allows you to create sections and pages, allows you to cut and paste things in, allows you to, to draw things. It's, it's really, um, you, you got some really cool tools around uh, uh, that, that helps you organize uh, and, and map thoughts. So we, we bring everything together, everything together in a central OneNote file, okay? And as the organization or the uh, account that you're working with, prospective or uh, customer account you're working with, as they mature with you, as they add new opportunities or add, as they add new projects, we create sections and each section will have um, a set of pages and those pages could also be appointments. So as you mark an appointment for this opportunity, it'll actually create a page of the data of that appointment and link back to the appointment file within CRM as well. So a lot of really cool uh, coordinated uh, activity going on here. Uh, the other thing we do is when a, an account reaches a certain stage of maturity, we also create a, um, uh, a chat window. Um, and, and so this is effectively a, um, a Teams channel. So I'll show you what that looks like uh, right now. I'm actually just going to walk away from the account here, go to an opportunity that I had uh, open for this account. And you can see that I have my chat. See here in um, Microsoft Teams, we create a team for basically... Um, Every, every account that reaches a certain stage of maturity, typically around the time of opening the, uh, the opportunity. And you can see here, I've got the, uh, the CRM opportunity form right hanging right here. I've got my notes file. So here's the notes file I was just looking at here. Uh, so if I wanted to, um, you know, maybe draw something really fast. Right, so you'll see that that's the same notes file that I had opened previously, right? So I'll just add a little triangle in here as well. It all comes together there. I've also got files. So here you can see a couple of files that um, I, I have on uh, related to this opportunity. If I want to upload another file. Okay, so third file has been added. If I go back to the opportunity record and I go to documents, you can see the, the third file there too. So we bring everything together. It's the CRM system for file management it is in the exact same SharePoint location that the Teams channel is uh, out of the box. So I don't do this. The Teams channel uh, is located. So um, all pretty cool there. You can see naturally you can collaborate here. I'm going to collaborate with my uh, sales manager. I got the order deals done. I'm going to schedule a handoff to services. I can invite the services team into this channel, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. It becomes a nice central way to organize all that kind of collaboration. 
The other thing that we do with um, the, the Teams integration is uh, pump out tons of notifications. So we have um, all these great uh, notifications that will fire out automatically on for event or campaign responses, poster forms being created and, and signed. If a, a seller gets an account uh, signed to them, they get a notification, contact uh, assignments. If an account moves to prioritize, we you know, explain that another time, but we automatically let the, the owner of that account know. Um, and then all the project notifications as well. So l basically really relying on, on teams for, for notifications and kind of bringing all that together as a completely out of the box configured um, experience. So there you have it, how CRM should be fully integrated to your collaboration platforms like Teams, document management like SharePoint, and using OneNote to centralize uh, a lot of that qualitative, uh, or, uh, qualitative kind of um, uh, information that exists on an account. So I'll leave you with that. Uh, thanks for uh, tuning in and um, have a great day.